Hello everyone, welcome back to Purple Carpet Squishies. Oh yeah, speaking of, this house is literally purple. I'm just gonna show you guys like a tour of this first house. I mean, not first house, but like a house that I built some time before. Back when I was like into playing Minecraft, I made a whole explanation of that on part one. And I'm sorry that that video ended so like abruptly because honestly, I honestly have no idea why. It was kind of like, I didn't want to keep editing it, so I kind of just edited, I mean, I left the video at kind of a random pace, so I do apologize for that. This one's going to be much shorter. I think we were talking about, like, um, oh, hello. We were talking about, like, journals and a lot of my interests and everything, and just discussing stuff, like Adopt Me and Minecraft and, like, why I quit and everything. So this is kind of a continuation. Um, basically, um, for, like, like I said, I do a lot of journals, and I write there pretty much like every single day back in 2021, and I have a lot of those notebooks as well as a video on that. By the way, I'm going to be uploading a part two on those videos very soon, so I'm not going to describe like what's in this house because you can basically just see that, so just look at it for yourself. Um, so basically, I was kind of copying um, Diary of a Wimpy Kid with that one, and lately I feel like I've been watching more Netflix than I'm actually reading, and I made a video of like um, describing the stuff that I um watch on netflix so right now i'm watching like last year i was super into greenhouse academy and i feel like fate wing saga is super close to that and wednesday the new um limited i'm not sure if it's limited but there's a new like season one of wednesday and it's just so good it's like i understand it's not for everybody but it's a really good show and i have like this document that um that's talking about like the shows that i watch and like basically everything that I'm into like for example a link of a bunch of like school short films that I directed in like school and everything and that's kind of just a document with holding a bunch of stuff and I also have like a YouTube channel that's posting a bunch of my personal videos and those videos are private so that I can just watch them um, in the future and I also have like um, a bunch of journals like I said and also this online document because I have this world in my head that's kind of like um, I don't usually talk about this, but I have this world in my head that I talk to myself with a lot, um, and I have a document that's just, like, writing all about it, so yeah, there I even made a YouTube channel, I think it was during online school, where I was, like, writing about, I mean, like, singing a lot of, like, covers and, like, songwriting, because I also do that during my free time, um, I do songwrite a lot, and I feel like it's such a random part of me. Um, and also, back when I was having, like, a drawing phase, I had a lot of, like, drawing obsession going on, and I just copied a lot of stuff from YouTube, so that's kind of what basically kept me busy during quarantine, but a bunch of the stuff I show are, like, many years before, because I like seeing, like, progress of, like, when I was a lot younger in, like, middle school or something. Um, I also write a lot of short stories, so I have, like, this document that's documenting all of those, and kind of, like, this... Um, it's kind of like this contemporary series that I have and just a bunch of like books that I wrote for my family for like their birthday because I also make a lot of squishies for their birthday along with that so I have a lot of paper squishy content about that. Also I remember being in like sixth grade and watching this like show that was like I think it was Pop Academy or something on Netflix and I love watching like children's shows on Netflix basically. Like, I remember watching Peppa Pig in just one afternoon and just finishing the whole show on Netflix. And also, like, there were a lot of other children's shows I watched. I think it was, like, this fairy cartoon and, like, Nickelodeon shows. I watched a lot of Nickelodeon shows for some reason. I watched so many Nickelodeon shows, like... And I also found this, like, website to watch those shows on, so that's very interesting. Um... Nowadays, I'm kind of just watching, like, kind of scarier shows, which kind of explains why, like, when I go to, like, the forest or something, I'm just so scared. Also, I just quickly wanted to talk about, um, like, my Shopkins face, which I will be making a video on TikTok about. It's just, like, I had this Shopkin obsession as well as this, like, watching slime videos, which I know are, like, not really trending anymore when I was in fourth grade. Um, there were so many people just playing with slime, but now it's kind of like dying out, but at the same time, this is kind of like the same, um, time where I'm really like into, um, watching people just play with slime, especially like DIY clay slimes because they're just so satisfying. And, um, yeah, this one is kind of like inspired by a fanfic that I made. I, I don't know why, but this is just, 
I feel like I read the fanfic and I was trying to make this Minecraft world that was related to it because there are a lot of like um, really heated fanfics out there, especially in Harry Potter series. And I kind of wanted to build that, which is in one of the worlds I showed you guys in one of my videos. So yeah. So about the time I was playing Adopt Me, um, I basically played it for about two years, kind of on and off. And I played it, it was like for several months and then I got bored of it and then stopped playing it. And at the time, I was making like a lot of, I think I had so many pets to make Neon. I think I wanted to make a Neon Glyptodon, um, Sasquatch, and like Fred Panda, St. Bernard, whatever. Um, I had a lot of like hopes on like things to make Neon in Adopt Me, but then at the same time, I just kind of didn't want to play it anymore. The game I usually play nowadays is like Pet Sim because it's less addicting, although it is a lot more boring. That's just my personal opinion. Um, also, I used to play like, I believe I used to play like COD with somebody, um, like one of my friends, and but I don't really do that anymore because um, I don't know. I feel like I got bored of it. So I had a really huge like gaming phase back in like 2020, and I was kind of going through treatment for something, and um, like gaming was kind of just like helping me a lot. But as you can see nowadays, I don't really do that that much. I feel like I have other hobbies to like tend to. Um, I definitely don't do drawing that much either, there are like other things and I've been just kind of busy with school because I am in high school now and I might make another video of like Shopkins and everything <laughs> because I really miss like the old things I used to play with and everything. Um, there is currently like somebody living in the house like taking up like the toys, my old toys and everything and it just kind of made me feel nostalgic and everything. I also have like I said a document that's like Netflix shows I watch. I love watching Netflix shows. I recently just finished Brooklyn Nine Nine. It was just sad. Um, I really wish it didn't have to end, but you know the thing going on with the cops in USA kind of like, caused that. Um, so there's that. Honestly, I spent so much of my free time just watching like slime videos and Instagram and um, kind of like a lot of celebrity <laughs> interviews. I don't know why I watch so many of those, but I kind of just like talk to myself about them. Don't even ask me how craft world. I'm kind of just talking because this is kind of my way of like therapy and everything. Um, I have made a lot of new friends in high school and it was just really fun. Um, so there's that. I also recently loved writing like poetry and like I said I like songwriting before. I play a quite a few instruments so I did a lot of songwriting um, and when I was learning to play the ukulele which is like a, several months ago and I was kind of just into that. Um, and now it's kind of like I do write poetry during my free time and just submitting to places and I feel like I have a lot of new hobbies nowadays and also photography. Um, so I had to clean up a lot of storage on my phone so I couldn't show you guys a lot of my Minecraft world. But anyway, here are some Shopkins as promised that I'm going to show you guys. Um, I do have a few paper squishy to Shopkin trading videos and I don't know if I should resume doing that because honestly I feel like I've kind of outgrown them. Also, I haven't really talked about books much, but I do do a lot of that in my my Instagram account, and I'm just really into a lot of things. Like I said about photography, I'm sorry, the last clip got cut off. The reason for that was majorly just lack of storage. It just came out as like a notification. But um, yeah, my storage is filled with a lot of like old edits that I used to make. Um, I had like this edit account before, and um, well, if you're my friend, you know what I'm talking about. So yeah, these are a bunch of like random. I had a lot of fun collaborating with a bunch of people on like um, photography stuff and also getting camera was really fun. I enjoyed like doing a lot of uh, magazine cutouts and that type of art. And also now I basically have my room de de decorated with a lot of photography. I made like there was this kind of last year, I made like um, a string of pictures that are like, I bought something that, that was really cheap obviously. Um, tying a lot of pictures and also a building board where I have a lot of like Polaroids and um, just a cute of a bunch of cute little printouts. You can find more of my room. It's kind of like the walls are kind of like ripping off the paint, but you can find more of that on like my other videos. It's just a bunch of random like Shopkin showing you guys because a cousin of mine just came over and just kind of reminded me of how obsessed I used to be with these things, so just enjoy a lot of that type of footage. It's kind of all for this video. It's honestly more of like a chit chat than showing you guys my Minecraft world. 
because honestly I used to play that like every day for a month and then I kind of got bored of it but now my account is being used by someone else so yeah that's basically it for this video thank you for watching um go make sure to check out the part two of my journal vlog and a lot of other videos to come see you guys next time and I also have more drawing content on my tiktoks you guys bye bye